All right, it begins. <laughs> Sorry if I uh, get in the way of the recording. If you can't tell, this is this is gonna be super ghetto for the time being because uh, I don't have the money to start a regular style gaming channel. So I'm just gonna kind of do what I do and uh, yeah, just do it. Just do it for fun, you know. So I don't know if you guys are gonna be able to hear this, if you can even hear me talking, if this is even good for my camera. I don't even know if I should do this with my camera, leave the lens exposed for so long. But um, yeah, we're just gonna see. And if you don't know, I'm playing some Fallout 4 right now. I think this is probably one of the best games ever created. Because <laughs> I mean, it's just so deep. And uh, yeah, I'm not starting at the beginning. I'm starting in the middle. I'm already level 33. So, uh, and not only am I starting in the middle of the game with you guys, I'm starting in the middle of a mission because my friend came over the other night and uh, kind of interrupted me playing. And I didn't want to bother him at this point, which is reading all of these, uh, you know, computer stuff. This is going to the front entrance. See, I don't know what this is about. I came to get some raiders that were attacking my settlement, you know, just to settle the score. And it led me into this huge underground passage. It was gone. Tartan is blows me around. Stop out today. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, where is Lil? Tom someone has hands on her. Uh-oh, okay. He's got her. So if you try to that little, he's making it right. He's like, uh, 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 this sounds familiar to something that happened earlier in this, uh, in this game. Uh, uh, oh. <laughs> I feel like back when I was like at Corvega, that plant, or somewhere around there, this guy. This little side lady thing I do before it happened. We'll find you, sis, wherever you are. I think she's dead. <laughs> I think she's dead. Oh my god, where am I? What is happening? Oh, I got Hancock with me. I don't really like him as a partner, to be honest. I just want to try him because I like ghouls. Okay, what are we doing here, Hancock? What are we doing here? Where are we? Okay, looks like I took care of this already. Am I supposed to be going down or am I supposed to be going in? I'm supposed to be going down. I'm so scared because I don't have any good weapons on me. Well, I got this. This is my sniper, Snipey. But I only have 20 more bullets left because I kept buying the wrong type of bullets. It takes another kind of bullets. What is this? Uh, 50 caliber? 0.50 caliber? And I thought it was 38 or 308 or something. And I kept buying the wrong bullets. So now I have no bullets for that gun. So all I have I is my pistol and my shotgun. Which has a fair amount, but the distance isn't really great. Uh, okay, let's see what's going on here. This is crazy because I'm in the middle of a mission and uh, I'm not sure what the flow is like, you know, like I just lost my flow. I don't know how far I've gone. It looks like I've looted this shit already. I feel like I'm going backwards. Yeah, I think I'm going backwards. This is why you can't stop playing this game when you uh, when you're in the middle of a mission. I am so lost. This is so embarrassing. This could be the way. This could be the way. 
I think it is. I hate these bright lights, man. It's like it's so unnecessary. So unnecessary. I'm close. I'm here. I made it. I finished the mission. Finished the mission. It's really quiet, isn't it? The volume. I'm gonna try and make it a little louder. Uh, and try not to block the screen. Uh, where is the remote? There it is. How's that for ghetto? <laughs> That is ghetto this right there. Oh, but it'll do. It'll do. Until I figure out, well not figure out, until I get the money to, uh, you know, set it up proper stylies. Okay, where am I now? What is the, what am I, what is the mission? Stop the raiding at Sunside Co-op. Report your success. Oh, so I already did it. I already did it, everyone. I already did the thing I was supposed to do. So I guess I finished the mission. I just wanted to read what was on that computer because I'm a nerd. And I like I like to uh, see what the story's about because the story is so sick. It's so deep. All right, let me go report my success to this woman. I think it's a woman. My settlements are garbage. I'm sorry. I don't really spend time. I don't spend much time doing the settlement stuff. Well, can I we stop worrying about paying tribute to those raiders? I hardly broke a sweat kicking their asses. Thanks. Damn Good right. to know we can count on you guys when we're in trouble. Damn right. Yeah, that's my character. Let me just show you. How do I do the... Talk to Preston? I'm always talking to Preston. Alright, I'll go talk to Preston. Back at Sanctuary, you would think that at level 33, my Sanctuary Hills would look dope. Maybe, but just haven't been paying attention to it. Haven't been paying attention to building. You have to like dedicate a whole session to just building, because that, especially if you're not like, I guess, uh, artistically talented in that way, in the architecture type thing, then it might be even it might take even longer. You guys should see my uh, Simpsons tapped out town. It looks like a freaking mess. <laughs> if you guys play the Simpsons. Freedom's always worth fighting for. What's up, Preston? Remember that settlement that was asking for help? All safe and sound again. Good. This is how we're gonna take back the Commonwealth. One small victory at a time. I'll let you know if I hear of any settlements that need our help. In the meantime, make sure to offer help to anyone that needs it. I can only help our cause. You got it, Preston. Mission complete. You know what I want to do right now? I want to... See, I heard... I, re I, I read, because, you know, I read up on the video games and stuff. Sometimes I, I, I see spoilers, and I read that you have to take Kiri, your, um... The robot companion that you saved from Vault 81, you could take her to the memory den and have her become a human, I think. So I want to do that, because I'm tired of this guy. I'm tired of this guy. I don't know what he likes. He doesn't like anything. He doesn't dislike anything. He just kind of follows me around and makes snarky comments. So I want to get Kiri back, because I like Kiri. She's cute. I wonder what has happened elsewhere. Is what has befallen the Commonwealth a typical, less extreme? Have you found someone that your enemy become human? She's so cute. She is so cute. Let's travel together. I'd like to travel together some more. Then let us get on their way. Let's do it. I'll send Hancock to, uh... Can I send him back to his, to his place? I can't send him back to his place. And I feel so bad sending them anywhere except Sanctuary Hills. Because everywhere else is so lonely. But, uh, maybe he'll have a good time in Hangman's Alley by himself. No, uh, I'll just leave him here. You stay here. I know you might not like it, but... And Kiri, you come with me. Let's head to... 
Good neighbor. Good neighbor is a cool town. I got laid there already by a hot singer. I don't remember her name. <laughs> it was just a quick fling, you know? But yeah, it's a good town. It's a good town with bad people. Or is it bad town? No, it's definitely a good town with bad people. That robot, that Cleo robot, oh my gosh. Is she ever something else? Is she ever something else? Here we go. Oh, can we see the old steakhouse? Maybe they have the tourist brochure. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe Kyori. Kyori? Oh, I always lose them. I always seem to lose them. Let's go see what happens here. I hope this works. Because she's cool as a robot, but she could be even cooler as a human. And we could find love. But the guy. The guy in uh, Diamond City, he fell in love with a robot that looked just like Carrie, and he, she loves him, and I think they're happily together now. Are you ready? This could be it, Carrie. This could be it. Let's just talk. Let's just talk to her. I'm hey. sorry your first time here was so... Well, all I can say is that you're very brave. Thank you. Hey there. Oh, enjoying yourself a good neighbor? It's a heck of a town, ain't it? Okay, this is not it. This is not it. How about you? memories of Vault 111? I'm so sorry we put you through that again. It's okay. <coughs> the memory loungers are complex pieces of equipment. Please don't lean on, jump on, or kick them. Joey, I'm sorry. This isn't it. This is not what we're looking for. This is not where you're going to become a human. Oh, I'm so sorry. Did I go in this door before? Have the memory pod loaded up? Oh, you're not Irma. What the heck? I was not in here before. Who are you? Hi. Good neighbor's crazy. Thefts, murders, worse. Sometimes you just gotta escape a little to make it through the day. Yeah, I hear you. I hear you. It's a mess out there. It's rough in the best of days. But now, you ever listen to the Silver Shroud? Huh. That's what we need. No matter how bleak things got, he saved the day. Yeah, I've heard of the Silver Shroud. Um, but uh, I didn't listen to it. But I don't want to tell him that because I don't want to bring him down. I don't want to be a dick. But I'll just say, uh, I'll ask him about it. What can it. you tell me about the Shroud? He's from the radio shows. I've listened to all 419 episodes and the holiday special. He's the best. Better than Grognak and Man-to-Man -Man combined. Grognak and Man-to-Man? -Man. Well, it sounds that familiar. Sounds familiar. You'd remember him if you heard his show. They're the best detective shows in the whole world. What if the Silver Shroud was real? With his black trench coat and gleaming silver submachine gun? I got a plan to bring him to life. Hmm? So we can fight bad guys and give the rest of us a symbol of something better. I kind of like this guy, man. I kind of like this guy. Uh, ah, should I humor him? I do want to humor him, but I want to know about What's his plan. plan. I've built my own custom machine gun, even better than the one in the show. But to make this work, I still need the most important piece. The genuine Silver Shroud costume herself. And they actually got one here in Boston. They made it for the TV show. Will you help? Hmm. Can I get a reward? I might do it, if you make it worth my while. <laughs> I can give you some caps up front. I'm not charming for nothing, alright folks? Help me. I'm not charming for nothing. Uh, I can't get any more out of him. Um, hey man, I'll get no, it. I'll get the costume for you. You're gonna do this? Hell yeah. For real? It's fun. Before the bombs fell, they were filming the Silver Shroud pilot over at Hubris Comics. I went so there already. So that's where you'll find it. You're the best. I went there already. And I got something else, but I didn't get the costume. I got the gun. I knew something crazy was going to happen when I walked into this room because I saw this guy outside the door. All right, buddy, what else you got to say? Be careful. The comic book store's in a real bad part of town. I've been there. It was full of you guys, you ghouls, but they were feral. I shouldn't discriminate against the regular ghouls. They're not feral. They're not bad guys. 
All right. Well, where's this tape at right now? I think that this is a perfect spot to end my first ever, well, not really. I had another channel that I made like, uh, I made a gaming let's play on that channel. It obviously never got anywhere, but I'll tell you guys more about that later. Try Hotel Rexford. What? Okay. Uh, yeah, I think I'm going to no, I gotta figure out, I gotta figure out if I have, cause it would be in my inventory, right? If I had got that costume, because that costume is one of the miscellaneous items and it would be in here. What I wanna check to make sure of is if another prop I got from Hubris Comics is in here and it was the Tommy gun. I went there, see, I got the hubris, that, I got the hubris star key. What I need is, do I have the Tommy gun? Please, uh, I at least have the Tommy gun in here. I don't know why, I guess I don't know why it would matter. Because he's not looking for the Tommy gun, he's looking for the costume. But I just want to see if I got it. I got the silver shot photo, I got the silver shot script. Got the gun prop. There it is. There it is. But how in the name, how in the name of everything did I miss the costume? Hmm. Well, I'm gonna figure it out. And, uh, yeah, that'll be next time. Catch that next time on next time's episode of The Silver Shroud. Uh. <laughs>